The war in Yemen has negatively impacted media in many levels. Assaults committed against media workers have undermined journalists to report news and stories about Yemen's war. Yet Houthis keep using their media to spread propaganda and hate speech. This report has more details. On the 19th of March 2008, the former President Ali Abdullah Saleh launched the commemorative channels Seba and Yemeniya as part of the 12 channels added on the ArabSat satellite. Since then, the date has been recorded a National Media Day to celebrate media professionals, whether in print, audio or video profession. This celebration came in confirmation of the political leadership's belief of the important role played by the media. After two decades of unity, there were about a hundred governmental and independent newspapers, as well as several satellite channels. But the chaos of what so-called Arab Spring caused the decline in press freedom before the Houthi militia violations took over what has remained of media professionals' rights. The International Federation of Journalists confirmed that, during the past 10 years, Yemen has witnessed the killing of 50 journalists, and Yemeni Journalist Syndicate documents more than 100 violations against media workers through each year. Violations varied between killing, kidnapping, and unfair trials, which resulted in death sentences of four journalists by a court affiliated with the Houthi militia. In addition to harsh and inhumane conditions that journalists confront in prisons, not to mention the confiscation of media outlets and suspension of media salaries by the militia for more than five years. This reflects the continuing dangers the journalists face on a regular basis in Yemen. Attention to media professionals came after the National Media Day, when Yemen has enjoyed a free climate and democratic approach. However, one could bemoan the country now suffering muzzle and violations against journalists.